guys welcome back to my channel thanks for stopping by so as you guys can see in front of me there is a lot of manga parcels so yeah this is going to be a sweet manga haul i feel like it might be a short one since this manga haul is predominantly kami sama kiss if you guys don't follow me on instagram at himaka underscore zero zero you guys know the journey of me picking up this series i tried to pick up as many volumes as i can so yeah hopefully all of them came safe and sound as these parcels has actually been sat at the back of my videos for two months now so i haven't opened them yet so they're way out of the return window so if any of them came damaged i won't be able to like ask for a refund or exchange or um a replacement so hopefully everything is fine i don't mind the blackwells ones because i know the blackwells parcel will be fine but it's just the amazon parcels um but yeah it's not just um kami sama kiss i know there are other series that i bought in this haul however I'm not too sure what's in size. Like I said, um, it's been two months. But yeah, during the two months, you guys know I was in um, London as well. I took you guys along with me to do some manga shopping, which I know you guys like. So hopefully we can do more manga shopping videos in the future. And also, um, oh yeah, by the time you're watching this, you've probably seen my manga bookcase as well. So there will be a collection video coming out very soon once I filmed all my hauls. Currently, I think there's five hauls lined up that I need to film. But once I've done that, there will be a collection video. So don't you worry, the time has come. Like I know it has been very long awaited and I know you guys are excited, I'm excited. Like I can't wait to organize my bookcase. Um, but I can show you a bit of my bookcase actually. Let me just slide it so you can see a bit of my parcels, my mug and some of my manga. But um, yeah, that's a little sneak peek. Well, it's not really a sneak peek because you guys would have seen it in the manga bookcase vlog. Um, but yeah, I really can't wait to just like sort this out you know and um yeah i can't wait to unbox all these parcels before we get onto this video as always please give this video a like comment subscribe you know the drill and click on the bell and feel free to use my affiliate links down below for amazon bright stuff and blackwells if you want to help support this channel and its future giveaways as you all know all the money that's earned from the affiliate links is all given back to you guys through my giveaways um but yeah it's a way for me to say thank you and also share the love of manga but yeah let's get onto this video so we got a mixture of Blackwell's parcels and Amazon. I'm just going to open whatever's on top. But let me just move it aside because I feel like it's just affecting the lighting. But uh, we'll go with this one. I've learned my lesson now. No need to use the scissors anymore. But yeah, let's see what's in here. So, ooh, it feels, it feels nice. Okay, so this is Kamin Sama Kiss Volume 10. Look how good that looks, sorry my ring light. I've noticed as well, Ruff Travelling Man has recently been selling Kami Sama Kiss as well. And they've been selling it for a very good price because all these um, volumes that I bought of Kami Sama Kiss, I either bought it for retail price or just under retail price by like 10 pence. So either I got it for like £6.70 or £6.99. Is this £6.99? Yeah, £6.99 or £7.99. There has been a few volumes that I did buy for £8 something, uh, but no no more than that actually so i only just realized that my audio wasn't recording so i do apologize for the last minute or so where the audio changed um but yeah we're back onto the mic now but i was saying that i don't think i've spent any more than eight pounds something on a kami kisama kiss volume i think the most i spent is um eight pound sixty i would say so yeah no more than nine pounds i would say um as i find that ridiculous as i'm pretty sure this series is in print but you know with the whole thing that's going on with the world right now every manga is dealing with low stock and also reprints are being delayed um so yeah if you saw in my earlier videos you know i did panic about this series even before collecting this series as i was gonna get it in japanese instead of the english version but i'm glad like i just stuck with it and just picked up the english ones as much as i can um i think i'm just missing about three or four volumes right now but hopefully they will go back in stock very soon um but yeah we i guess we just have to be patient that's with all manga series to be honest but this is what volume 10 looks like and i find the cover art so beautiful and also the spine definitely very very pretty and very shoujo like um but yeah this is one of my favorite series when it comes to anime i have read a bits of the manga i think i went up to volume six by the way this series is completed and it goes up to 25 volumes that's why i say this series is a big commitment like if you want to collect the series go and get all the volumes as much as you can like i said i'm not too sure if it will go out of print one day but yeah 
yeah I, I really like this series um and I can't wait to read more of the manga I have watched all of the anime it is one of my all-time favorite animes I will say but yeah this is definitely a series that I turn towards to a lot when I'm feeling down but yeah this is what the cover looks like and the back but yeah do let me know if you've ever read the manga or watched the anime so on to the next parcel i'm pretty sure it's going to be coming summer kiss like i said this haul is predominantly coming summer kiss so let's see what it is oh it feels really nice yep oh yes yes so the reason why i reacted like that is because it is volume four of coming summer kiss and if you know about this series and you know volume four this volume for some reason it is literally one of the hardest volumes to get of this series i don't know why it's so rare is it because there's less reprints i have no idea but black wells has been a godsend like once they sent me a notification saying that this was in stock i literally grabbed it and when i grabbed it they actually sent me an email saying that they had no stock and then i think a few days later they sent me another email saying that it's restocked again and then i literally bought it straight away and i was hesitant in receiving this volume as i think i received a dm or either a comment in my comment section where someone has said that they've received um, a used volume before by Blackwells. Personally, I never experienced that. Everything has always been brand spanking new, like you can see here. Um, but I was concerned that, like, since they did the restock so quickly, it might have been like used or something, like someone returned it or something like that. But nope, this is a brand spanking new volume, and this volume is gorgeous. Look how pretty it looks and the spine and the back but yeah i'm so glad i got volume four because this volume cheese is a hard one to get and um yeah i'm glad i have it in my collection let's open the next parcel but yeah i can't wait to put this series on my shelves oh this series is not coming summer kiss by the way it is fire force so this is fire force volume 10 and um the reason why i picked this up and if you know i only own volume one of fire force actually let me just show you like this so if you can see here i only own volume one of fire force um so this is going to be quite scattered in my collection um it's because this volume was actually quite cheap i think yeah retail price this series is for going for £9.99 and I think I got this for like £5.70 I would say the most I paid would be like £6 um, but yeah that's because big shout out to Caitlin also known as Kate Tins' manga she let me know that on um, Fire Force some of the volumes were going for a cheaper price than retail price so yeah I picked up as many volumes that I can of this series that were on offer so yeah that is volume 10 um, I haven't read any of the volumes other than volume 1 but I really did enjoy volume 1 so I can't wait to just continue collecting this series but I'll say I will slowly collect this series since the retail price is £9.99 so the only time I'll be picking this up is when it's on offer I guess but um yeah I think once I read about like three volumes I'll start the anime but I've heard lots of good things about the anime too so either I try the anime now and slowly collect the manga and then read the manga in my own time like when I have more of the volumes I say so yeah that is volume 10 of Fire Force I feel like with this series every volume looks pretty much the same like the spine and that the only difference is the um, cover and also the volume number but yeah that is volume 10 of Fire Force and then this parcel it doesn't even I think this is an eBay parcel actually um, you see oh oh i've broken the bubble wrap one second so this package is from ebay um let me just chuck this scissors out you know got tape i wonder what volumes these are cool i'm pretty sure this series yeah it is my boy look at that oh the condition looks beautiful so i got volume two and five of my boy if you can see here isn't the cover art so beautiful i feel like this art style is just too stunning in my opinion um but yeah i picked these volumes up on ebay as these were a lot cheaper than retail price as you guys can see it is brand spanking new and if you didn't know ebay does do brand new manga not just secondhand manga as there are like a lot of bookstores that have ebay accounts that sell their like stock so yeah i always check on ebay to see if they have like volumes that are cheaper than retail price as if i don't shop on blackwells i normally shop on either traveling man or ebay but i think i might do a video on like where i shop and buy my manga i feel like that would be a nice video to refer to on my channel um but yeah these two volumes i'm really excited to read it um which one's volume two yeah this one is the next volume that 
I will be reading. I think I might read it after this video actually. Let me show you some pages to show you the art style. This series is definitely very beautiful and Mangaluna proper put me onto this series. With this series, my boy, I am currently up to date with it um, physically as I have picked up majority of the volumes on Amazon as well. And if you don't follow me on Instagram, go follow me. That's where I update you guys if I ever find any like awesome deals as on Amazon recently, a few of the volumes of this series had a significant price drop like I think I got volume free for like £4.66 or something and then some other volumes for £6 something and normally this series retails for £10.99 which is very dear in my opinion as this volume is not like a typical big volume like how should I say it's not like a thick and tall volume like water koi let me get it like ooh. Yeah, it's not like a typical volume like this where like it's worth the price as it is a lot smaller if you can see here and it is the same like slimness as a typical manga volume um but yeah like um i'm not too sure by the time you're watching this would the price drop still be there on amazon but if you know i hope you picked up and try out this series as this series is a great one and i can't wait to read more about it it does touch on some sensitive topics so um yeah i want to put that out there if you want to hear more about my opinion about this series do check out my manga wrap up where i did talk about this series briefly but yeah that is my boy so back to my black bars parcels this feels a lot thicker than usual um i think there's probably like two volumes in here but let's see so ooh, what's this okay it looks like more fire force so i got fire force volume 11 here so this is what the cover looks like the spine and the back like i said earlier a lot of them look pretty similar it's just the difference is the front cover actually excuse me why is the back looking the same okay let me just show you i don't know i just noticed this that the back all looks the same this is kind of um I don't know how I feel about that. Yeah, I noticed the back, they both have the same back. That's that's odd. Like normally like the back would normally look a bit different, but um yeah, I guess I guess they didn't have enough time to do more stuff with the backs and that stuff. But yeah, like I said earlier, a lot of the volumes look pretty much the same. Um the only difference is literally the front cover, but um this is what volume 11 and volume 12 looks like. Um, I do apologise um, as I haven't watched any of the anime or read any further than volume 1. So I don't know what these characters are. But yeah, do let me know if any of these people in the front are your favourite characters. But yeah, that is volume 11 and 12. But yeah, I, I don't know how I feel about the back just looking the same. I don't know why I'm feeling a certain way. But I won't say too much because I feel like I might say some mean stuff. But anyway on to the next parcel so the next parcel is oh what a surprise it's another volume of fire force so this is volume 14 and oh this guy looks a bit hench mm, hmm, you know <laughs> but yeah the back looks the same oh my god um but yeah this is volume 14 do let me know down below if you like the series fire force um but yeah i can't wait to read more of it but i would need to fill up um the gap first because since i own volume one and now into the tens i would need to get like two volume three four five six and that stuff before reading it but um yeah that is volume 14 um should we start on to this parcel let's get on to the bigger like cardboard parcels and then we'll get back to the white ones again i feel like a bit of variation will be nice oh, don't want to cut myself i'm very accident prone if you can't tell oh 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 <laughs> i ripped it like this so they're like this so it looks like lots of kang salmon kiss volume so let's just slide it out like this if it works so it looks like volume 22 of Kami Sama Kiss. This is what the cover looks like. My God, yeah, this is what I like. Different artwork on the back. Um, yeah, this is what the back looks like and the spine. The spine is definitely very beautiful. I can't wait to put it on my shelves and see how it looks. I think I might show you guys how all these manga looks on my shelf after. I think that will be a nice change. Um, and then volume 23 and volume 17. I think, yeah, this volume on um, Travelling Man is going for like £4.99 or something. So very, very cheap. I wish Travelling Man put some of the Kami Summer Kiss volumes out earlier. Then I would have got the deal. But I don't mind paying retail price for this series. Um, oh, 
the volume looks so white I'm so happy because since this series is quite old I was like kind of um, worried about the volumes being a bit yellow as you know when volumes sit in the warehouse for too long they do go yellow I do have actually let me show you as an example like I have had manga where it's from the warehouse where it's just turned yellow like this Arjun volume I don't know if you can see on camera but in person this is this is even darker than me so um yeah um some volumes from the warehouse can get yellow um just the way they like store their manga and that stuff but i'm really happy that this literally looks pristine white so yeah this is volume 23 and volume 17 cover art oh, this this looks so cute doesn't that look cute it looks like a little family. I'm really excited to read more of Kami-sama Kiss. Like I said, I've only watched the anime and I've only read up to volume six of the manga. And I've heard a lot of people said the manga is a lot better than the anime. So I'm intrigued to read more and see how it goes. And I'm really excited to see how Nanami and Tomoe gets closer. As I know from the volume 25 cover art, they do get married. So... <laughs> I don't know how that happens but I'm excited to read it. This is definitely a nice sweet shoujo series that I can't wait to read more of. Even as an adult woman this is very appealing to me. Sometimes I feel like certain shoujo series like it's more catered to like the younger audience and it's hard for like adults to read. Like I read a series called this um, Ultramaniac from one of my favourite uh, mankas, Wataru Yojizumi. This series is um, very, very kiddie-ish. Like, as an adult woman reading this, it just felt, felt too young, you know? There's something about Kami Summer Kiss that makes it appealing for me as an adult woman as well. I don't know, maybe it's just because of Tomoe, you know, because he's so good looking. Um, but yeah, I'm really intrigued to see how this series goes. So let's see what other volumes is in here. So it looks like, ooh, this is a bit, <laughs> And look how close Tomoe and Nanami is together. Oh, I'm really liking the cover arts of Kami Summer Kiss. Definitely one of the best looking shoujo manga like cover arts and also spine as I know certain people have complained about shoujo manga looking the most deadest compared to like shonen manga um, but that's their opinion uh, but yeah this is volume 11 and volume 16 wow look, look how cute this looks I don't, oh yeah, I don't think I can ever get over how beautiful the cover art is. But right now, as you can tell, I am buzzing to read this series. But I think that is it for this parcel. Okay, let's open a bit of these like white parcels. So, oh, now you can start seeing my stack growing right now. Um, hopefully, I'm gonna count and see if I do have 21 volumes of *Coming Summer Kiss*. Oh yeah, this is volume nine of *Coming Summer Kiss*. This one was another volume that was like a rarity as well that was hard to get but I managed to get it from Blackwells once they sent me an email notification but I think they've done a bit of restock as I have seen this volume around on Book Depository and Amazon and is there any other websites? Yeah, I think it's just those two websites and of course Blackwells that have volume 9. But before there was literally, volume 9 wasn't even in sight on any of these websites that I've just mentioned. But um, yeah, that is volume 9. And the spine and the back. Definitely very, very pretty. Um, some more manga. I think all of this is going to be Eva coming Summer Kiss now. So all that we're going to look at is just the cover art. So the next volume I got is volume 13 of Fire Force. And oh, they, they look very interesting, don't they? Um, but yeah, like I said, the back looks the same. So no need to show you guys the back. But um, yeah, I wish I can flick through some of the pages. But since these volumes are quite later on already, I didn't want to spoil too much for you guys. But yeah, hopefully there will be volume one of um, Kami Sama Kiss here so I can show you the pages as I love showing you the pages of manga to give you guys an idea. But um, yeah, let's see what's inside the next parcel. Oh, did I buy that many Fire Force? Um, it's another volume of Fire Force and it is volume 15. And this is what it looks like. I think I've seen someone talk about this character. I think it's Mangaluna saying that this is one of her favourite characters of Fire Force. So, um, hmm. I don't know who this is. But yeah, let me know down below who this guy is. And if he's OP or anything like that. So now I'm pretty sure this is all going to be Kami Summer Kiss. So, um, yeah. Let's see. I wonder which um, parcel has volume 1. 
So this is, oh, this is beautiful. Look how beautiful this cover art is. This is so, so pretty. And I love how they choose like different colors as well, like the theme, like this one's a bit like a minty green. So yeah, this is what the cover looks like. Spine and back and this is oh it's volume two okay since it's volume two i can show you a bit of the pages i feel like oh yeah i don't have volume three of this series either i'm not too sure if i mentioned earlier but i'm missing coming salmon kiss volume three five eight and 21 yeah but um, i'm gonna show you a bit of the pages of this series as this is volume two so there won't be a lot of spoilers i absolutely love the anime of this series and the oaths like the theme song Literally, it's playing in my head right now, but I won't sing it because I don't want to butcher it. Shall I, can I, can I hum it? Like, mm. Okay, I think that's enough. Um, but yeah, I absolutely love the anime, but I'll insert like the caption and all that type of stuff throughout this video, so don't worry. But let's see what the art style looks like. Yeah, this is what the art style I remember. I remember like the art style does look slightly different in the anime but it's pretty much the same to be honest um but yeah this is what volume two looks like and yeah i'm so excited to read this oh. yeah that is it for volume two and then all these parcels that i'm gonna unbox now they're all from amazon if you guys can see here so let's go um yeah, I'm so sorry this haul is just me unboxing loads of parcels and it's just only one series. But this is volume 14 of Kami Summer Kiss. So far, all my volumes have come in pristine condition. So I'm super happy as, like I said earlier, I was worried in getting a damaged um, volume. But I'm glad everything is in good quality and in brand spanking new condition. Um, but yeah, this is volume 14, if you guys can see hope it focuses and the back I feel like I always fail with unboxings when it comes to filming but um oh there's two volumes in here hey there's volume one in here okay now I can show you um more of um Kami Summer Kiss this is volume 15 and the back oh, it looks so pretty and then volume one so this was the most expensive volume that I got out of the bunch as I got this from Amazon and I paid about nearly nine pounds for this it was like eight pound 70 i think but um when i got this i'm not too sure if amazon went down in price for volume one but i remember i did pay a lot more for this volume but um yeah yeah retail price this series is only seven pound 99 okay i guess some volumes are six pound 99 and some are seven pound 99 by the way i just want to put it out there i do apologize if i seem a bit tired and that stuff and a bit out of it is because today i'm just having so many technical difficulties with my camera like it keeps on shutting off and just overheating i think it's because the weather's getting hotter so it's just been playing up so hopefully all the clips are fine but yeah on to the blurb of kami summer kiss and at the back it says a divine comedy yeah, this series does have a lot of comedy aspects in it. But yeah, Nanami Momozono is alone and homeless after her dad skips town to evade his gambling debts and the debt collectors kick her out of her apartment. So when a man she's just saved from a dog offers her his home, she jumps at the opportunity. But it turns out that his place is a shrine and Nanami has unwittingly taken over his job as a local deity. So basically a local god, shall I say. Nanami has all kinds of new responsibilities she doesn't understand, dangers she's unaware of, and a cranky ex milia who's actually pretty hot, which is Tomoe, which you guys can see. Um, what's new fledged godling to do? So yeah, that is the blurb of Coming Summer Kiss. Hopefully that sounds interesting. But yeah, let's see what other volumes I got. And um, yeah, let me just break this parcel. But yeah, I really do feel like this series does top it off for me with the shoujo like covers like i think this is one of the best looking shoujo series to be honest like the spines look so good and i can't wait to see it on my shelf so it's all aligned but yeah this is volume 19 looks like that the beach volume 13 oh this is really nice as well kind of reminds me of autumn and then yeah that's volume 13 and the back another cute picture and then volume 25 so this is actually the last volume of the series 
so yeah it looks like they get married so i'm really interested to see how this series goes and it looks like nanami has a lot shorter hair i wonder why her hair got shorter is it because they want to show that she's grown up um yeah i have no idea and the back oh yeah don't read the blurb of course because that might spoil things um a lot of people do read the blurb somehow i don't uh, yeah i only read the blurb when it's like the first couple of volumes but when it comes to like later volumes i never read it as definitely those are big spoilers and then there's only three more parcels left for this haul so we'll be done soon don't you worry but yeah the stack is definitely a lot i'll show you guys how it looks like once i um pick them up later so the next volume i got is volume seven of Tammy summer kiss so oh there's two volumes in here so the next two volumes i got is um volume 20 this ooh, this feels very tight for some reason um that's what the cover looks like oh the back is beautiful look at that back yeah that looks gorgeous wow let's just see that again once more <laughs> and then um volume 18 and the last parcel finally oh that was satisfying as well <laughs> i really like these parcels oh there's two more volumes as well and that is volume six so like i said i've only read up to volume six i feel yeah so i can read volume six and seven i might have to buy volume eight digitally for now so i can continue reading the series and hopefully volume eight will come back in stock but yeah this is what volume six looks like oh the back cover of this is beautiful as well the art can you see Sorry, my ring light's probably covering it. That looks so pretty. And then the last volume is volume 24. Hmm. So this is what it looks like. And also the back. The back is cute as well. Um, but yeah, that is it for this haul. And the stack is kind of wobbling. Oh, it looks so different on camera, not gonna lie, compared to in person. But um, let me just fix this up and I'll show you guys. So one second bear with me lifting all these volumes up to show you guys my haul let's pray they don't fall i'm literally gonna shit myself i feel like and wow this is what this haul looks like look at the amount of volumes but yeah there's 21 volumes of kami summer kiss right here and <laughs> this looks crazy i'm gonna put it down oh crap it's gonna stop all over i feel it i feel it i'm gonna put my chin down but yeah i'm gonna put these um manga on my bookcase so i can show you guys what it looks like so i just put all the manga from the haul onto my shelves and they look absolutely beautiful like look how stunning that looks but yeah definitely kamisama kiss volumes like the spines these have to be the prettiest spines i've ever seen um, but yeah, I like how the images as well look down below here. But yeah, looks so good. So I'm just going to say goodbye now. So I hope you guys have a great weekend and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give this video a thumbs up and comment down below and that to help support this channel and that. And yeah, I hope you guys have a great day. Keep on staying blessed and I hope you guys are healthy and that. And I'll see you guys next week. Bye!